Given away though by Victor and Torga. Arslan in behind and puts Melbourne City in front. Less than four minutes on the watch. And it's a superb finish by Tolgay Arslan. Who in a season of upheaval has been City shining light. And he's into double figures. For the first time in his lengthy career. What a start for City. Fernandes with the throw. The head of Diego. Caputo. Intelligent back for Jugarkovic. Talbot. As Jakulic wide right. Plenty in the box for City. And here's Jugarkovic looking to square it up for a teammate. And it needed that intervention from Roderick Miranda. Well, Steve Jugarkovic just untracked and very dangerous sign. That's a victory. The big Portuguese defender, Arzadi. Lovely work in tight spaces. Had no right to get through. Here's a chance for Lobby. And Jamie Young with a really good save to deny the equaliser. Great save. Mouthwatering football. And Daniel Arzani's futsal childhood in full view. Look at that. Beautiful sole of the foot, then skipping past with a little messy shift to open up the field. And then Falami does very well. That's a big test for Jamie Young. Strong right hand. Great action. Arzani again. Little one two with Mashash, is it behind? Alzani, Jamie Young to the rescue again for Melbourne City. Two big saves to protect that early advantage. Victory starting to warm to their task, perhaps. Falabi, Forderoli on the turn. Supriya makes the block. City desperately throwing bodies in the way. Brimmer trying to place it. Jamie Young again. Make that three big saves. Brilliant from victory. Brilliant from Young. Brilliant A-League football here at Amy Park on Derby night. The North Terrace in full voice. Their team in full flight. 16-17. Triore. Brimmer. He was caught late there by Jugarkovic, but play goes on. Arzani goes for the early cross. Oh, and Guerrier's trips. Penalty. There could be no other verdict. And there's about 5,000 victory fans behind that goal, willing him to square the ledger. And Fornaroli thumps it into the back of the net. And we're tied up at 1 1. It's 18 goals in 18 games now for Bruno Fornaroli as he takes another step towards the golden boot. Marzani working the corner short for T. Change of angle. Marzani's cross in. Bruno at the double. But it's not going to count. Flag is up. Verdict has gone in favour of Melbourne City. Bruno Fornaroli was wheeling away in celebration. To launch it forwards, and the chase is on. Falami against Tolden. Falami gets there first. Looking for an option. Adama Traore, goodness me. Big chance, Melbourne victory. Teague once more. More conventional this time, it's in! Damien De Silva! May we pull a victoire! Melbourne victory 2-1! Well, what about football? Lackey comes away with the ball, and it's too strong for Veladon, and slides it through for Marin Jakulic, the foot race is on. Jakulic gets there first, Arslan! Oh, what a chance! What a chance for Melbourne City! And he spoons it over the bar, incredible! Oh my goodness! City desperate to get the ball, but it's too late! Melbourne victory win it, thanks to that late goal from Damian De Silva! On the balance of play, Tony Popovich will perhaps feel his team deserved that. 
Although City had a good spell in the second half. Melbourne Victory confirmed their place in the finals. And have they condemned City to a season without finals for the first time in a decade? It is the end of Melbourne City's 11-match unbeaten run at this venue as well. It was hard-earned. Bruno Fornaroli on the score sheet from the penalty spots. His 18th goal in 18 matches before De Silva's late winner. All that after Tolgay Arslan had given Melbourne City an early lead. Fornaroli and Volupole had goals ruled out for what turned out to be correct offside decisions as well. All in all, this was quite the derby. Final score at Amy Park. Melbourne victory two, Melbourne City one.